Guys, it's Nick. I'm here in Bratislava, Slovakia, and I'm gonna go check out the old town. But before I do, I want to see what the food prices are here. I don't see an Aldi's, but there's a Lidl behind me, so I'm gonna go in there and see if I can uh, film some prices uh, before they throw me out or something like they did in Frankfurt. So let's go in there and see what the prices are like. Uh, this supermarket's in kind of the city center, so it's probably going to be a little more expensive than ones on the outskirts, but let's see anyway. here which is about a dollar ten so if something says one euro it's like a dollar ten jam like 219 not bad do they have peanut butter oh they do 319 for this little thing for Aldi's I get like 32 ounces for like 350 wow I should buy that I need some Red peppers, two ninety nine. It's expensive. Tomatoes, ninety nine cents uh, for three hundred grams. So a kilo is three thirty. About three dollars and sixty cents. Beer, point seven nine. Point three nine. Wine as cheap as one point seven nine. Spanish. Some cheap uh, vodka two twenty nine. No, four thirty nine. Coffee. 100 grams, half uh, one pound, about five bucks. That's about average. Uh, there's no way this is 115. Maybe it's this small package. Croissants, 27 cents. I bought some this morning in Vienna at uh, Hoffer, which is Aldi's for Vienna, for 59 cents. So half the price. their own bread cutting machine. <laughs> I've never seen that before in a supermarket. So like $1.69, 169, 100 grams of ham, prosciutto, 169, also 100 grams. Seventy-nine for 150 grams. That's about uh, a third of a pound, or about five ounces. A little high. One twenty-nine for 100 grams. Eggs, cheapest eggs, one ninety-five for ten. And then you have the more expensive, free-range or organic or whatever. Two sixty-nine for half 300 grams so half a pound of butter for 269 there's some other ones I don't know if this is pure butter but uh, similar similar to uh, Vienna milk dollar nine for this very good price I'd say Probably some really good milk. What is this? It's like pre baked bread or something? <laughs> I never saw that before. Chicken breasts. 49 for 687 grams. So 
So that's uh, more than a pound. Toothpaste as cheap as a dollar thirty-five for Colgate. Oh, really? This stuff, buck twenty-nine, will last you a long time. So it's got clothing and stuff like uh, Aldi's does. Flour, dollar twenty-nine for that little thing. Olive oil, one ninety-nine extra virgin olive oil. That's crazy. Six ninety-nine for some better stuff. Pasta sauce. One, 129. Holy pasta, 79 for half for one pound is very good. 69 regular. This beer, I never saw this beer in like a plastic two liter Coke bottle kind of thing. How much is that? What, a dollar nine? A dollar nine for this. And if you drop it, it doesn't break. So that's a new one. I haven't seen that before. Ice cream, $3.99 for that. Not bad. $3.29 for these. Fries. This big bag of fries. 2.5 two kilograms, $3.99. It's cheap. Limes, $0.49. Cents. And I know people are going to correct me saying it's not cents. It's uh, 0.49 euros or whatever. Uh, just go with it. Potatoes, four ninety nine for ten pounds. That's similar to what I pay in Florida. Chocolate, a regular bar, a dollar. That's about right. These fancier bars, dollar seventy nine, ninety nine. 74% cocoa, 4.49. No, this is 1.19, I think. Avocados, 4 for. Is this this? 4 for. Or 2 for 1.99. Or this pack for 2.29. Cucumbers, 89. Got a lot of these small little tomatoes. A lot of different kinds. I've never seen so many kinds of tomatoes. Got us $1.39. The security guy is busy on his phone. So guys, that's a look at Lidl Supermarket in Bratislava. I gotta say the prices uh, look very similar to Vienna, similar to, a lot of the stuff is similar to the stuff I get in Florida at Aldi's, kind of in line. Some, some things are a little bit cheaper, but maybe supermarkets out in the suburbs are even cheaper than this place, but not some, not bad deals in there. So that's, that's inflation around the world or not. Uh, let me know what you think. Are these prices expensive compared to where you live? Let me know in the comments down below. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you in the next one.